coffee here. It's a um, <clears throat> oh, that's different. I got a cold brew with four shot oh four shots of sugar free vanilla and one shot of sugar free white chocolate. I don't know how I feel about it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, welcome. My name is Brittany Johnson. I'm here with my mama. We just got some coffee at Cafe Neo. I'll leave it there. I don't know if it will be seen in this video, right. but <laughs> um, but we're actually out garage sailing, about to hit our first garage sale. It's Saturday. Um, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already. We um it's actually my mama's birthday. She just turned, can I tell them how much how old you are? She's turned 55. She looks incredible. <laughs> um, but we are at Cafe Neo. We just grabbed some iced coffee before we go. We are, they actually have, this is like a Greek coffee shop. But they actually have, this is like a Greek coffee shop. So they have like Greek donuts. Mm -hmm. She's been here before. I've never been here. She's never had the coffee here, but she's had the, like, the cool good. You should try this. Is it? Really? Yeah. I mean, I like it. I don't know if it's your. Yeah. They all taste, they all have a weird taste. I don't taste like yours. I think that mine tastes better than yours. <laughs> <laughs> mine tastes better than yours. Yeah, I don't like that. But it would probably be better all mixed up or something. Well, it did mix up some. Well, not like this. Like how mine True. started like real dark at the bottom. Yeah. And then you got the, I had to get the heavy whipping cream. I got just a large um, cold brew with four shots of sugar-free vanilla and a shot of white chocolate sugar-free white chocolate they have a lot of sugar-free options which is nice because that's one thing i don't like about starbucks is that they only have sugar-free vanilla and i think hazelnut but that's it which i don't understand why they don't have more if like other places can get lots mm -hmm. more it doesn't make any sense was there a pork and stuff in there mm. yes i was wondering how we were gonna eat this but i'm just vlogging today i decided decided to to vlog because we're just I don't know which is which but we'll figure it out. Mine, yours was on top. Uh, yeah, I don't remember. That about this one, yours. She got traditional. I got the Nutella. Oh, I just got chocolate on my <laughs> I just flipped chocolate. But I got oh my gosh, this smells very good. They make it fresh. Oh my gosh. Ah! So she said it's like a mix between like an elephant ear and like a funnel cake. For mine, the Greek. The, uh, yeah, traditional. the traditional. They're just like like fried donut holes basically. Um, this one's drizzled with Nutella. Oh my gosh. My, this one has syrup, nuts, uh, powdered sugar on it, and I think cinnamon. Yeah, that sounded good. I just didn't want to get the same thing. So I'll probably have to try it by ears. <laughs> Yum. It's really good. Definitely tastes just like a like a mix of those things. Like uh -huh. that's what the breading is or whatever. Very good. Yum. Come on. Mm. I feel like they're harder than what I think that I thought they would be or something. But I'm also just eating like the crunchy reports, so but there we go. So hers looks like they can't see it if you're trying to show them. Okay, there you go. Yours looks almost like orange chicken from like China yeah, place in the box. <laughs> so we're home now. Say hi. Say hello. Can you wave? Hi. Hi. <laughs> um, we came home. I dropped my mom off. Um, and John and Hayden had to hurry up and go to her t ball practice. So. I can't show you what I got at the garage sale, but we went garage sale shopping and I forgot to vlog like the garage sales and stuff, but 
we weren't we went to a couple they were all pretty much duds i just got one thing but i actually got an espresso coffee machine so shout out to my mom because she was like well i'll pay half because it was like she was selling it for 135 it was a brand new never open espresso virtuo um and i was like i don't really need to spend the money i literally just got a coffee machine for christmas but this one makes like espresso and i have been wanting one that makes espresso shots and um the espressos are super nice so i was just like oh, i don't know i don't really need to spend that money and she was like well i have for your birthday because my birthday is next week hold on there's somebody like pulling in oh they're turning around i'm like what's happening um anyway what was i saying um so i was like i'll offer the girl what if what if we pay 100 instead of 135 and she's like sure i'm like she said sure like right away and i was like well dang yeah i should have offered like 80 or something <laughs> i'm like having buyer's remorse like i hate when i pay something that they could have like gone lower if they wanted to and i'm like i just don't like spending money but um like that type of money the things i just like don't really need but like i don't know it's such a good deal so i was just like okay so i'm excited to try that out but i'm out here in my boutique workshop john just took Hayden to t-ball I decided to stay home with Everly because I need to get um, packages packed. I was supposed to do them last night when the girls went to bed, but I literally fell asleep. And I was like, well, I'll just do it now because the post office doesn't close until like 1130 or noon. So I'll be able to get them all finished if I get off of here and quit talking. <laughs> I'll be able to get them all finished and sent out today. So I'm going to go do that. And then I don't know what else we're doing today, but I will keep you guys updated. I'll show you the Nespresso when my husband gets home. Trying to impress me, pulling out all the stops Making my dizzy when you tell me what you want I just wanted you to see me Never thought you'd notice Thought that you should know I'm already sold so Never let me go You had me at a la 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 I just finished packing up all the orders Wow, there's some loud bugs or whatever <laughs> outside. Um, Everly's taking a nap. Hayden, or John is taking a nap. Um, but um, there's actually two people who are on my road or like right down my road and then the road next to us that um, ordered from me. So I'm just gonna drop them off at their mailbox for them. And then there's like a big garage sale going down the road, so I think we're gonna walk to there also while they're all sleeping. So that's what we're doing now. All right, you can put it in there. Can you reach? Good job. Is that the one we do now? Nope. I gotta look up her address. Oh. The other girl. Sit down, baby. I'm not turning you around. Okay. All right, we gotta look up the other girl's address. Okay, we're back. I'm sweating. I'm gonna take my shirt off. Um, I'm just in a sports bra and shorts right now. Um, I've got so much sweat. My tank top was like, had that line of sweat. Um, John left to go play basketball. Now it's just me and the girls here. Um, I'm hungry, so I'm snacking on some, some of these. Sorry this vlog, I feel like this vlog is horrible. Like I just want to like literally just not even keep filming and just delete this whole whole day because I feel like I keep forgetting that I'm vlogging and then I'm just coming on here to talk so I'm sorry this vlog is horrible <laughs> um, but I set up the Nespresso so the thing is so I opened the Nespresso like I said I forgot I was vlogging or else I would have unboxed it together um so I set it up it was clearly used um, I opened the box. They said it was supposed to be brand new. I opened the box. It was clearly used and in the box it had a return slip from the from the previous user. So obviously it was like a return item like new but used. One of those situations. So it turns on but the, the box said it came with like a 12 pack of the espresso pods or like the Nespresso pods. There's no pods in there at all. So they were all used which is just funny, they returned it, but then they didn't return any of the pods. They used all the pods, but clearly it wasn't good coffee if they, you know, use all the pods. Um, 
sarcasm. So I can't even use it, I can't even try it. Um, I washed it all out and everything, but it did come with the frother, which I'm excited to use and everything. Um, I need to wipe that frother down though, but I wiped this all down and I need to do like a rinse cycle, but I'm not really sure how to do it yet if I don't have a pod. I'm not really sure yet, I haven't looked much into it, but um, so I either gotta order Nespresso pods before I can even use it, or I think I saw that Best Buy has them because they sell Nespresso, so hopefully I can get some there, maybe tomorrow after church, so I can use it. Um, but then we went um, walking to deliver the packages and there was a huge garage sale and I picked up a big, um, or it's not huge, but a Bluetooth speaker, it's a billboard brand. Um, I've been wanting a Bluetooth speaker out in the garage while I pack orders just instead of using my phone just because I want it to be really loud. And so I figured I would get that. It's charging right now, but the, the music was pretty loud. It's not like insane loud, but I spent $5 on it. He was like, how much would you give me for it? And I was like, uh, $5. He was like, sure. I was like, okay. I'm like, every time people ask me how much they offer, I immediately am like, well, I don't want to like lowball them, so I'll feel bad. But I also don't want to yeah. get too much because like, what if they would offer less? Like, <laughs> like it's $5, Brittany, calm down. But anyway, my arm's hurting holding my phone like this. I'm starving. I've been eating like crap a lot lately. Like, I've just been craving junk food. And I'm like, of course, two weeks before my vacation, I lose motivation to want to lose weight. That's my luck. But it's okay. I had my weigh-in assessment at the gym this week. And I didn't lose any weight, but I lost three inches, two or three inches around my waist. I went down a lot in body fat. So that means like I went up in muscle then if I didn't like lose any weight. So I think I'm still doing fine. I'm doing pretty good with the balanced eating lifestyle. I just don't think I'm like losing weight. I don't really know. I think working out and lifting weights is helping a lot for sure. Like pick up the slack from like eating unhealthy, but this is an apple, so. Um, I'm sure you guys don't want to keep watching me eat, so I'm going to get off here and probably keep eating chips. So, yeah. So, we went to the movies and we saw the movie Spirit Untamed. It's just like a um, animated kid's kids movie but it was really good mm -hmm. with my parents it's my mom's birthday so she wanted us to go she wanted Hayden to go with her for sure but we all just went um and then we came home and now I put the girls to bed and me and John have just been hanging out on the um our deck just relaxing enjoying it's super nice weather out I can't really see me but that's what we've been doing and now I think we're about to go inside and probably watch a couple episodes or one or two episodes of the queen of the south which is on netflix highly recommend if you are into like all the drug cartel <laughs> type of uh series netflix series we love them we're big fans um is that what we're gonna do we're gonna watch that show okay but we have church in the morning and i, I gotta be there at 45 you have to be there at 45 yeah. okay are we going to go with you? Probably not. Probably not. You won't get up. <laughs> yeah. I don't like to have to get up that early. It's a lot. But then I hate having to get the girls up and ready all by myself. And then all loaded up. And then taken to church and stuff. But you know what? What was I going to say? I do it for... The kids. <laughs> do, I do it for the kids. No, it's like, do it for my squad, do it for my gang. Do it for my squad, do it for my gang. TikTok sound. Yeah, We're going to do that. And we'll check with you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. We are on our way to church. John left early this morning because he has to be there at 8.45 and we just don't so <laughs> we do not get up that early we wake up yeah we wake up when he leaves because it's just too loud and the kids wake up uh when he like is getting ready and stuff which is fine but it's currently 10 o'clock right now um i feel like 
like my hair looks very voluptuous today. I use the, um, it's like the Big Sexy brand hairspray. And I usually use the like Garnier for Peace one because I don't like the crunchiness of the Big Sexy one because it's very like, holds really hard. But I did like, I held it far away and I sprayed it. And I feel like it, it's not super, it's not crunchy at all, but it like made my curls very like big looking. I don't know how to explain it. But we went, um, we have such a freaking ant problem. I don't know if anybody else is dealing with this, but it's really annoying. We have ants everywhere. Like they start around my, started around my sink. What, baby? You want a donut? I'll get to you in just a second. Um, they started around our sink and then we kept having to like kill them and get them away or whatever. And then they moved to our pantry. So la this past week, they were like all over our shelf, one of the shelves, so we had to like empty out everything and wipe it all down or whatever, and then and now they're on the bottom shelf, and they were gone for like three days, like we barely had to deal with them, and this morning we woke up and they were all in our cereal, in the cereal boxes, so that's cool. so annoying, it's so frustrating, I literally cannot stand ants. <sighs> so I texted John he was like okay we gotta do something so we're gonna figure out some type of concoction DIY something to like kill the ants so like attract them all to like die <laughs> sorry if you are an ant lover but we just do not want those all in our food we're gonna empty out our pantry wipe down everything so there's nothing like sticky that maybe they're like attracted to or something I don't know but that's super frustrating so that's what we were dealing with this morning but so we were that's so I was saying that because Hayden went to get a bowl of cereal to eat breakfast and it had ants in it so it was like okay well I was like well if we get ready early enough we can go and get some donuts at a one of the like coffee shops uh, that's on the way to church so that's what we did I just got some coffee um, I just got it's from Bismarck um, donut and coffee shop um, and I just got they have like a drive through which is nice and usually it's really busy but it wasn't busy at all today there's only one car in front of us so that was nice um, but Hayden got what you want to tell them what you got do you know what they're called tiger tail and a regular donut yes tiger tail and a regular donut a glazed um and I figured she probably won't eat both of them so I'm gonna give some to Everly we'll see is that good yeah and then i just got a um iced coffee yeah a cold brew coffee with um four shots of sugar-free vanilla and one shot of or one pump of sugar-free uh caramel so it's pretty good actually um i said light cream and i don't know if they put any cream in it because it's pretty dark but I, I swear i said light cream at the place i went yesterday and it was like white <laughs> so i don't really know um, but it tastes pretty good. I just, I just want my drink to not be so dark, but I know that if it's like a healthier drink, like it's not going to be real, um, light or anything. You knew that was going to happen. Watch Emily. Mm. All right. How are you doing? Hey guys, sorry for this horrible lighting. I don't know if, if this will help. Oh yeah, that helps a little bit. Um, we were just playing pickleball. I didn't vlog today barely at all we went to church and then after church we went to texas roadhouse with my parents um and that was really good and then it came home took a nap and then we woke up and john stayed home because he wanted to mow he's obsessed with mowing he wanted to mow and me and the girls went with my parents to um play pickleball so that's what we were doing we love pickleball it's such a good workout it's just like tennis and like ping pong mixed together if you don't know what it is but um in our town like it's really big like there's lots of people who play it's really fun um really intense it's a great workout like I feel like I was a huge I was huge into sports in high school so I just love it and I, I play tennis so um anyway uh we are headed home almost home now and I'm gonna end the vlog here um, and I will hopefully get this edited and up this next week. Um, so stay tuned for that. Don't stay tuned. Obviously, it'll be live if you're watching it. But um, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Sorry the vlogging was a uh, subpar. But I hope you guys enjoyed it uh, a little bit into my life. 
um, leave me some suggestions below what things you want to see um, video types whether it's vlogs um, day in the life of uh, like a boutique owner or um, any actual like sit down videos or questions you guys have that maybe I can answer for you guys uh, that will really help me out I feel like I'm just doing vlogs all the time because it's the only thing I really have time to film because I can't really have time to sit down and have quiet time to actually like do a sit down video because I got girls um, but anyway, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already, and I will see you guys in the next video. And by the way, I'm just driving down my, like, road that's, like, super, um, quiet and, like, nobody drives down here. Um, anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, guys.